I yield one, uh, two minutes to the gentleman from Oregon, Mr. Schrader. The gentleman from Oregon is recognized for two minutes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, Mr. Speaker. It's with a pretty heavy heart that I'm on the floor here today. This should have been a high point. I listened to the good chairman and even the Rules Committee chairman about this is a way to get the bill to conference. I've heard people say this is the only way to get this bill to conference. Well, we had another way, and that got sabotaged. And I guess the point I'd make to this body and to the people at home is that, uh, you know, some of us are listening to you. The most important thing is for us to work together. That's what I hear back home. They don't know about the details of all this policy. Well, colleagues, how a bill gets to conference is as important as getting it to conference. Doing it with one party, ramrodding it through, without listening to half of America, that's just wrong. This is anathema to what America wants to see happen. We are ceding our authority to the Senate and to the President. The Senate will never take this up. The President has said he will veto this bill. Why not go back and work together? That was the message of two weeks ago. We got it wrong. That's a legislative process. It's not pretty. We should have gone back and worked together. As you've heard, Democrats are willing to work with our Republican colleagues for a good piece of legislation. I'm proud of American Farm Bureau, National Farmers Union, and others who still oppose this bill because we're not working together. This is a travesty, and they recognize it. American agriculture is under siege. World economy, global competition, it's gotten scary out there. Now they're under siege from their own Congress. Colleagues, that's unacceptable to all of us. We can do better. America deserves better. I ask my colleagues to research and check into their hearts, vote their conscience, search their moral compass. Let's work together to defeat this particular bill.